What's up, everybody? Welcome to another episode with my pal Alex and Feisty Pants. Found these two Pokemon tins this old Gengar and this old Gyarados for Feisty Pants. He's gonna love them. I was wanting to check out some baseball cards. We got some Yankees here. A little Sabathia action. All right, Carl. Oh, what's this? <laughs> now hold on player we got ourselves here a triple tag triple tag triple threat something this right here i don't know if you can make it out is Derek is Derek cheater <laughs> is dylan batonza's rookie card right there that there is a tops rookie card all-star rookie emblem you know we're gonna pick this up the triple threat i'm talking about of course is Araldus chapman and paul and paul miller paul miller uh andrew miller oh who the heck is paul miller Paul Miller used to pitch for the Pirates back in the day. All right, let's go. Uh, let's go purchase this, and uh, we're gonna rip this open in the car. What's up, everybody? Welcome to another episode of Alex's Toy Show. So you saw the haul. Here it is. That was me shopping in there, and I picked up the Dylan Batonsis pack of shit here. I don't even know. I don't even know what's in here. But there's. It says there's 100 baseball cards plus a pack. So hopefully we get something more than a Dylan Batonsis. Oh my God. Hopefully we get it open. Oh, open this shit. Oh, I got it. I got it, everybody stand down. It was it was double cardboarded. Wow. Alright. Here, check it out. Dylan Batonsis. It's actually got some good corners here. It's the uh, update series, 2015 update or oh actually it's not the update series. It's that Yankee team pack. See how it's labeled NYY4? That's, uh, that's the Yankee team pack that you buy for like five bucks at like Five Below or wherever you buy them from. Um, wow, that's f fucking awesome. That's even a little more rare, right? Because you don't see those everywhere. And Topps regular cards, you know, they're mass produced to your blue in the face. All right, so we got a pack of Triple Play. Donruss made those years ago, but they're bought out by Panini. Okay, well, seven cards per pack. It doesn't say what year it is. 2012 copyright date. All right, so pack of sh pack of shit there, and uh, wow, we got a real mountain of shit here. All right, so I, I broke it into two piles. Let's let's fan these out here. Uh, yeah, John Morzano. Now, some I flipped through these pretty quickly, and it looks like there's a lot of like hard to get sets. Like this Andre Dawson is not just 89 dollars; it's 89 dollars baseball best. And the only way you got this was if you bought the set. Um, they didn't they didn't sell packs of those and there's a lot of um, there's a lot of cards like this you know uh, Darren Jackson okay here's a, oh hello there's a pair of Nolan Ryan cards now these came in a Nolan Ryan set or were they packs I think they did packs of those actually I, I could be wrong oh Roger Clemens oh you big fat fucking cheater yeah we don't we don't take Roger Clemens cards in this house Dwayne Ward. I think that might be a Dwayne Ward rookie card. He was a uh, he was a reliever, and he had success in the closing role for a while. Uh, Stan Belinda. Yeah, see, this is Fleer update. That's not just regular 1990 Fleer. That's Fleer update. Wow, pretty cool. I I like the the rarity of the card itself. Um, oh, Alan Trammell. Very nice. Very nice. It's just that I didn't get many. I didn't. Well, I, didn't, I shouldn't. I shouldn't say many. I should say any. I didn't get anything of great significance aside from that Dylan Batonsis card. Chin Ming Wong. I like Chin. Yep. Now this guy here, David Zancanaro. Yeah, these were one of the four A's. The four A's aces back in the day. All, all four of them crapped out. And see, like, here's another one. This Rick Cerrone on the Brewers. This is from the 1986 Topps Traded. This is kind of like uh, the update series you'd find today in stores. And the only way you got this was if you bought the set. You couldn't buy them in packs. Um, very similar story here. Here's another one. Uh, Ernie Riles. 90, 91 Topps Traded. 91? 91 Topps Traded. How to buy the set. <laughs> oh, yeah. Good times, though. Good times. Rafael Santana. Rafael Espy Griffey Jr. 
Sally Jesse Raphael. Sally Jesse Raphael S.P. Griffey Jr. the third. I gotta save that one and show my brothers. We call him short for Cecil. My buddy Bill Radice knows that one. <laughs> Bill Reed the Icebox, where you been, man? I haven't heard from Bill in ages. I'm friends with his sister. I don't think she knows who I am. Um, well, not that she doesn't know who I am, but I don't think she realizes that it's me from, you know, back in the day. And uh, it's funny. Got some other good cards here. Well, not really, like I said, not really great cards, but, you know, decent cards. I had a lot of these back in the day. And, uh, Alfonso Soriano. Uh, all right, here's, uh, here's this. This is the other half of the box. I broke it into two small piles. Pretty cool. Yell when you see something awesome. 1988 score is the year I kind of got back into baseball. I had a lot of the wooden border. See, here's another Topps traded one. Mark Lewis on the traded team. Uh, I had a lot of 87 Topps and some 87 Fleer. And like buying Donruss in the 80s, in the mid 80s like that, you could not get a Donruss card out of the box that was mint. This is Fleer Update Series. 1989 Fleer Update. You, you had to buy the set. You didn't. You couldn't buy that in packs. I, I, I like the, the rarity of the cards. I just don't like the, uh, you know, I don't like the players. <laughs> I don't like the players at all. The players suck. I don't know, not really. Oh, here's here's a here's a fancy one. 1991 Donra, uh, Donruss. Ugh, let me get up. 1991 Upper Deck Final Edition. Again, very similar to the update series. It was it's just the name that they use. The, the name. It's just the name that they chose to uh, to use. Bowman 92 Bowman. This is one Bowman. One went off on a rocket. I had a Mariano Rivera card. Turned out, I think it's like 80 bucks. I don't even know what it's up to. But I was like, no, nah, this is that kid on the Yankees. Here's another one. Jose Aquendo. 86 tops traded. Had to buy the set. You didn't get those in packs. Here's another one of those um, final cards, final edition cards. Jack Morris, final edition. He, uh, he just said, give me the ball. They were in the World Series. He pitched like four games. Something like that. Four out of the seven games in the World Series. Never heard of such a thing. Joe Necro, he's been playing some ball. Carney Lansford, one of the better third basemen in the game. I think uh, he was runner-up to Wade Boggs a number of times. Or vice versa. Pinnacle. Studio. I like the studio cards because it showed the baseball player not in their uniform. And it was kind of cool to just kind of catch him, you know, very... Average looking, you know, not average looking, normal looking maybe. Some, oh, we got some Alex Rodriguez action right there. Now, this is not one of the Alex Rodriguez cards. It's one of the season highlight cards. Still pretty cool. I mean, it's a nice shot of uh, of him in action there. I'm going to save that one out with the Dylan Batanzas. All right, this is almost the end of it. And then we'll open up that pack of shit that I got. <laughs> the shit pack. <laughs> Oh, these are team leaders. All right. There's a pool holes on there. That's pretty cool. All right. Let's see. Uh, let's see who's in the shit. I can't open it. <laughs> oh, this is awful. All right. Here we go. Oh, well, they're different. This is ultimate shit. This is fucking terrible. All right, here you go. Joe Maurer, pretty cool, but it's all cartoonish. Like, I don't want this crap. Alfonso Soriano. Here's uh, here's Matt Kemp writing a notebook. That's what I want to see. Uh, Ricky Romero. I don't even know if he plays anymore. Uh, here's a Grady Sizemore sticker. Pretty cool. And uh, Carlos Lee. And Jose Bautista, Joey Batch. Well, that's worth it right there. And these are like the back of a puzzle piece, you know. They go to something bigger. All right, folks, that was the Dylan Batonsis car, uh, card box, whatever you want to call it. Dylan Batonsis. Yankee team card, not the regular Topps edition. Like this video, leave me a comment, and subscribe for more!